Heather's Heather's plushies and I'm very excited for this package right here because there are two more Magnus and Home plushies and that means it's their SOS basically so I'm really excited so let's get them out of the package oh my gosh I'm so excited The zebra's on the top. Oh my gosh, he's huge. Oh my gosh! I'm going to take a look at him before I get the other one out because I'm just so excited. Oh my gosh! He's bigger than I expected! Here's the Magnus and Home Paul. Ooh, I like that. So I believe... Yeah, they're basically from SOS. Yeah, see? Manufactured by SOS. So, oh my gosh, the body length. Oh my gosh. So, I don't really connect with too many zebra plushies, and I don't know why. But this one, I just really liked, and I think that's a big reason is because he's realistic. And has the body length. And you're a little too floppy, buddy. You can't even stand up. I think I might try to add some stuffing, which I hate to cut plushies open, especially SOS plushies, because they're my favorite brand. But, I mean, poor baby can't even stand up. I mean, I guess he or she can lay down, but, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Might, I probably will add some stuffing in the legs because look at that but oh my gosh and I love the mane by the way oh my gosh here's the tail I'm so happy I love SOS so I basically got the SOS zebra now yay couldn't beat the price it was only what $24 wow I got you to sit up finally <laughs> I'm just so blown away because I love SOS. Okay, Zebra, and I'm going to have to name you. And now I'm not going to go with the basic name Strife. I'm going to name him or her a special name. But anyways, oh, wait, let me see your ears. <gasps> oh, they did the airbrushing. Look at that. Look at that. can't see your mouth that much because it's black but okay let's get the how do you say it oka pie oka pie out oh my gosh they're stuck in there. oh my gosh okay I'm gonna put this box out of the way now we have a bunch more room oh. and this is the first magnus and home plush i have that still has the hang tag so and that's all this on the hang tag is the same thing on both sides really <laughs> wait yeah see i love how sos plushies have eyeless oh my god i love this brand so much. SOS is the best zoo animal brand, and I'll just say the second. And well, SOS is the top for me, at least. That, in my opinion, SOS is the best. I mean, if you were to go to a zoo, wouldn't you rather see these nice plushies rather than cheap plushies? I'm sorry, Wild Republic. I love Wild Republic. But I love realism. Not that Wild Republic isn't kind of realistic. It's just they have the cheap fur is the main thing. That is the main thing. They're cute. It's just the cheap fur. But just these guys are... Like, they have their body length. Like, Wild Republic, 
they're like sitting and they don't really have their full body length. I mean, which makes them cute to sit on the shelf, but I love realism and that's why I not only love SOS plushies, but I also love hand. So, yeah, let's take a look at this oak pie, however you say it. And you don't have a Magnus and Home sign on any of your paws. This is the first SOS plushie that doesn't have a Magnus and Home. Or, this is the first Magnus and Home plushie that doesn't have a Magnus and Home on the paw. On any of the paws. Which is weird. I'm trying to see if it's blending in or something, but I don't think so. Let me feel for any embroidery. Nope. So, where is your Magnus and Home? I mean, you have to have one. You have to have one. Huh. That is a little odd. But, oh, look at that face length. That face length. This is just... Whoa. Do they have, like, horns that were, like, cut off up here and, like... They literally put those on there. They're really good at this. Like. Look at this adorable. They both need names. I just love all of the detail. All of the stripes. The material of the fur. Oh my gosh. And there's the ears. No fur in the ears on these two, but they're not wild cats, so. I'm really happy with both of them. Okay. Let me set them up for the thumbnail and I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. The zebra's on the top. Gosh, he's huge. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna take a look at him before I get the other one out because I'm just so excited. Oh my gosh! He's bigger than I expected! Here's the Magnus and Home Paul. Ooh, I like that. So I believe. Yeah, they're basically from SOS. Yeah, see? Manufactured by SOS. So the body length oh my gosh so i don't really connect with too many zebra plushies and i don't know why but this one i just really liked and i think that's a big reason is because he's realistic and has the body length and you're a little too floppy buddy you can't even stand up i think i might try to add some stuffing which I hate to cut plushies open, especially SOS plushies, because they're my favorite brand. But, I mean, poor baby can't even stand up. I mean, I guess he or she can lay down, but, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Might, I probably will add some stuffing into the legs, because look at that. But, oh my gosh. And I love... The main, by the way. Oh my gosh, here's the tail. I'm so happy. I love SOS. So I basically got the SOS Zebra now. Yay. Couldn't beat the price. It was only, what, $24? Wow. I got you to sit up finally. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm just so blown away. Because I love SOS. <laughs> okay, Zebra, and I'm gonna have to name you. And now I'm not gonna go with the basic name Strifes. I'm gonna name him or her a special name. But, anyways. Oh, wait, let me see your ears. <gasps> oh, they did the airbrushing. Look at that. Look at that. can't see your mouth that much because it's black but 
Okay, let's get the, how do you say it? Oka pie, oka pie out. Oh my gosh. There's stuff in Oh my gosh. Okay, I can put this box out of the way. Now we have a bunch more room. And this is the first Magnus and Home Plush I have that still has the hang tag, so. And that's all this on the hang tag is the same thing on both sides, really. <laughs> Wait. Yeah. See? I love how SOS plushies have eyeless. Oh my gosh. I love this brand so much. SOS is the best zoo animal brand, and I'll just say the second, and, well, SOS is the top for me, at least. The, in my opinion, SOS is the best. I mean, if you were to go to a zoo, wouldn't you rather see these nice plushies rather than cheap plushies? I'm sorry, Wild Republic. I love Wild Republic, but I love realism. Not that Wild Republic isn't kind of realistic, it's just they have the cheap fur is the main thing. That is the main thing. They're cute, it's just the cheap fur. But just these guys are like, they have their body length. Like Wild Republic, they're like sitting and they don't really have their full body length. I mean, which makes them cute to sit on the shelf, but... I love realism, and that's why I not only love SOS plushies, but I also love hand. So, yeah. Let's take a look at this okra pie, however you say it. And you don't have a Magnus and Home sign on any of your paws. This is the first SOS plushie that doesn't have a Magnus and Home. Or, this is the first Magnus and Home plushie that doesn't have a Magnus and Home on the paw. On any of the paws. Which is weird. I'm trying to see if it's blending in or something, but I don't think so. Let me feel for any embroidery. Nope. So, where is your Magnus and Home? I mean, you have to have one. You have to have one. That is a little odd, but oh, look at that face length, that face length. Oh, this is just, whoa. Do they have like horns that were like cut off up here and like, they literally put those on there. Oh, they're really good at this, like. Look at this adorable. They both need names. I just love all of the detail, all of the stripes, the material of the fur. Oh my gosh. And there's the ears. No fur in the ears on these two, but they're not wild cats, so. I'm really happy with both of them. Okay. Let me set them up for the thumbnail and I'll be right back. And there they are. Got a thumbnail photo. I had to stand the zebra by leaning him against the oak. How do you say it, guys? How do you pronounce it? I mean, I love him and his back legs are like this. So he could sit. The thing is, Mr. Zebra is missing some stuffing in certain spots of his legs. As you can see, he's bending. So that's why she is not standing up. Oh my gosh. Look at all that detail. I am so, if I can count how many times I said, oh my gosh. But why is there no embroidery? First Magnuson Home plush 
in my collection and that I've ever seen or heard of that doesn't have the stamp. I mean, I'm not disappointed. It doesn't matter to me. I mean, <laughs> the plush is what matters to me. And they're in great condition besides someone not having. But, like, their fur basically feels like brand new. I mean, and I got both of these from the same seller. So, yeah. They were kind enough to refund my shipping for one of them and send them together. So I only had to pay shipping once, which was really nice. Um, but they weren't that expensive. And I'm planning on adding more Magnus and Home Plush to my collection. But these were the main Magnus and Home plushies that I wanted besides the... Wolf and the two white lions. I mean, I really want the two white lions. I have the SOS wolf, but I want the Magnus and Home one too for some reason. Especially, like, Magnus and Home made a bigger version than the SOS one. And that's the main reason why I want the Magnus and Home one. I want the bigger version, the one bigger than my SOS one. But besides that, um, besides those three, um, these were the main two other Magnus and Home plushies that I wanted. And I got them, and I'm really happy about that. Now, I'm not huge on elephants and rhinos. I just never really got into them. I mean, I don't hate them. I just never really got into them. I'm not really that interested in having plushies of them, but... For some reason, I really like the SOS slash Magnus and Home versions because, well, for one, they have the, um, well, they're not exactly scales, but they have, like, the, I don't know how to explain it, but you guys know what I mean. They have, like, let's just call them scales for now, and that makes them look more realistic. I guess you call them wrinkles. I have no idea, but it makes them look more realistic, and I love that. So I do want those two, but I'm still not big on elephants and rhinos. So I don't want them hugely. I mean, I've been wanting these two for a while, and well, I've I can't remember if I wanted the SOS zebra or the Magnus and Home zebra before. But the zebra doesn't pop up as much as the Okapi. So I've really been wanting the Okapi for a long time. And then when the zebra popped up, I'm like, oh my gosh, that's like the only zebra plushie that I connected with. Like, for some reason, just to the zebra plushies out there, I just don't connect with them. They're not really that realistic. I think the biggest thing is because this one has like the actual body shape. The body length, you know. His legs are standing up like that and but he's still floppy. The mane, I mean everything about him I love. So finally have a zebra plush that I like and I love zebras. Don't get me wrong, it just seems like not really any, there's not really any good zebra plushies out there. I mean, there's cute zebra plushies out there, but not realistic. Except for this one, I finally found the one. And of course it's SOS. SOS is the best for realistic. And hands off, but if you want a realistic plush that stands up and go with hands but if you don't like the stiffness and that they're not floppy then go with sos because they are floppy they're not stiff and you could always flop them if you flopify them if you want but 
I don't know exactly if we can do that with hands because they have like a whole skeleton inside of them. So you would have to take the whole skeleton out. Yeah, I wouldn't ruin the hands of plushies. So if you want floppiness, go for SOS. They're the best. So, yeah. <laughs> I talk a lot, but I'm literally trying to like, this is not, what's the word? I can't think today. This video is not sponsored or anything. That's the word. Not sponsored, but... Um, I'm basically kind of promoting SOS because that's how amazing they are. They're my number one favorite plushie company and they always will be. So... Go get SOS plushies if you can because they're amazing. <laughs> like I said, this isn't sponsored. I'm just doing it because I love the company so much that I recommend them. But also, um, they're out of business. So you can't really find them brand new anymore. So you have to find them on eBay or something. <laughs> but... Or something. That's why I'm laughing. I'm like, or something. But <clears throat> some people say that zoos still have some in stock. But once they sell out, they're not going to have any get any more in because unfortunately the company went out of business at the end of was it 2019 or 2020? I think 2019. Anyways, so yeah, as always. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in my next video. Sorry for the long talk. I'm in love with these plushies. I want more from them. This is the perfect size. 18 inch plushies are the perfect size. The perfect size for me. My favorite size. Um, so yeah. Of course I wish. Oh yeah. I think they have a giraffe. I do want to get that guy someday. But I didn't want him as bad as these two. But, I mean, whatever other um, animals that are like these, I wish they made some of. And maybe they did, but they're not popping up on eBay. But, like, what's that one that... Isn't it in The Lion King or something? Is it called an Avidark? Or... It's brown with a black and white stripe and has horns. If you know what I mean. It's light brown, not dark brown. So... If you know what I mean, yeah, it would be amazing if they made those. And I'm sure there's so many other animals I haven't thought of this. Would be amazing if they made. I want SOS back so bad because they do the most perfect job on any and every animal. And there's so many animals that they did make. But there's also so many animals that I wish they made and I'm sure if they would have stayed open and not went out of business they would have came up with new designs and made them so like is there any way to get SOS back like can't we sign a position or something like please I want SOS back they're my number one favorite brand I'm gonna cry now because I just started collecting SOS and a couple years later they went out of business. I'm upset about that. But, I mean, you can still find them online. But just think about all of the possibilities they could have made if they would have stayed open. I mean, we still have uni toys, but SOS is just special. Alright? I love uni toys, but SOS is still the top. Even though they're both from Leosco. Okay. As always, I hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you in my next video. Magnus and Hope. Huh?